Sydney Ice Dogs make a road trip down to Docklands for their first game of the 2011 season to play the Melbourne Ice. Tough first game against the defending champs, but good barometer to see where the team's at to start their campaign. Yeah, here's the uh, new first line for the Dogs this year. Brooke Robson with the park centres for Matt Monaghan. Good save there by Stu Denman. Matt Monaghan's got a hell of a shot. Yeah, and here's uh, Mitch By working the boards here. Another import of ours. That, uh, that's a first goal, first blood to Melbourne Ice there. Matt Armstrong bearing the puck yes. behind Jimmy Herbert. Yes, yeah, set up by Jason Backley. Absolute quality player. Uh, Brooke Robson here, rushing the net. Misses wide, unfortunately. Going to see some good things from him this year. Uh, Melbourne here on uh, power play. Great shot there from uh, Webster, but even better blocker save there by Jimmy Herbert. Good blocker hand. Here we see some great work by Jimmy Herbert. He's looking sharp in net, which is good signs for the dogs yeah, and a great, to start a campaign. A great glove save right there to kill the play. Here's uh, another power play. Back leg to Joey Hughes in front of the net. Yeah, look. Just slid under the pad of Jimmy Herbert there. Yeah, back leg sneaky guy getting behind the net like that. Here's White putting a shot on net. Rebound comes back to the dogs here. One hand's going to put it in front of the net for Brett Thomas. Great goal that one. Tomo looking very good in his first season back as an ice dog. Here we've got uh, power passing to Armstrong for just an absolutely amazing slap shot from the wing there. Unlucky for the dogs, bit of a defensive breakdown really. Um, so they'll want that one back. Yeah, quality shot nonetheless. Here's uh, Todd Stevenson putting one on back like there. Great hit. Um, Pop straight back up though, did, did Jason Backlick, so good good on him. Yeah, he's a tough cookie, that kid, but uh, here's uh, D-man import Ricky Holmbrecht showing his speed as he weaves around. Yeah. Scotty Herbert on the break here. Rebound coming back to the blue line, and uh, here we see a brain snap from Thomas Manco clotheslining Matt Armstrong. Yeah, he took him down pretty hard there. Yeah, this will uh, this will put the uh, ice on the power play here uh, for the start of the third period. Um, but uh, as you'll see, doesn't stop the dogs. Anthony Wilson dumping the puck in behind the net. Brett Thomas coming in here to get the puck back, but uh, blows a tire. Awesome work by Scotty here. Picks a pocket of back league, puts a backhander on net, and Tomo cleans it up. Yeah, he's second for the night. Well, what a what a great um, return for him. His first game back. Yeah, good passage of play. Short-handed goal too. Yeah. Should add. Here's uh, Ricky Helmbrecht again, just showing his puck handling skills as he weaves in and out of five guys. Tough to line up. Yeah. Definitely. This guy is going to show some good things throughout the season, I think. Yeah, very strong on the back end, I think. Yeah. Webster here, passing the puck up for power with just a great slap shot in the five hole there. Yeah, just yeah, great shot on the power play there for the Melbourne Ice. Here we go, last, last play of the game here. Jason Backlick at the back of the net, just giving way too much time there to slot that in. Yeah, absolutely. You give a guy like that all that time, he's going to hurt you. Yeah, and that'll uh, wrap the game up. Melbourne Ice win this encounter 6-2 and uh, keep their undefeated record for 2011. All three game stars going to Melbourne here. Matt Armstrong, Tommy Powell and Stu Denman getting the awards. And here's what Ice Dogs forward Brett Thomas had to say after the game. Yeah, pretty good. Uh, had a, uh, first game is always going to be a bit nerve-wracking, but um, I think boy, boys play pretty well together. Just uh, made too many, too many penalties to uh, cost us a game. So, but yeah, it's awesome to be back. Yeah. yeah, pretty good start. Uh, two goals. You, you, you never expect to uh, get two goals to the first come back. But, uh, puck was there, pretty net. Two goals uh, was an awesome way to start the game. Yeah, and, and uh, especially when we were down on a uh, five and four, we had uh, a short-handed goal, so that's pretty special. Yeah. yeah, the boys were well together. We, uh, you know, we ground out down the corners, and uh, we communicated well, and we skated hard, and we uh, gelled together as a team, which was awesome. So it's, uh, yeah, it worked well. Yeah, I think the team uh, played really well together. It was just uh, a few, a few penalties uh, hurt, hurt us a lot, and I think out of the six goals, there was five short-handed goals. So apart from that, it was like what would we, what, what we say, like six five. Uh, yeah, I think the boys played really well together. Yeah. We're just going to work on our uh, mistakes, try to minimise the mistakes we made, put the puck, in the, uh, puck down in the corners, work hard, and more shots on goalie, and um, stay out of the box. We didn't play discipline hockey. And uh, we said that at the start of the game, but uh, you know, we've got one more game to uh, pull our finger out, and that's, that's what we'll do. 
The next episode of Ice Dogs TV will also be from Melbourne when the Ice Dogs take on the newest team in the league, the Mustangs. So keep your eyes out for that in the next couple of days. And if you haven't already, subscribe to our YouTube channel and that way you'll get all the latest Ice Dogs TV updates. We've also just created an email address, so if any of you have any questions about the show or ice hockey or comments or any suggestions, feel free to give, it, to give us an email. I mean, even if you just want to shout out on the show, send us that and we might give you one. So send us anything you like and make sure you tune in next time to Ice Dogs TV.